Hey, what's up guys? Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to uh, make any image, um, an anaglyph image in Photoshop. And what that means is you can put on 3D glasses, red, blue 3D glasses, and the image will appear to be three-dimensional. Um, it's actually really simple, and I think you'll have a fun time doing it. Um, and so we can get started right now. The first thing we're going to do is open a photo and I have one on my desktop named flower.jpg so we're just going to open that. So when we open it we have our flower layer and I'm just going to readjust Photoshop really quickly so please excuse the adjustments I'm doing. Um, okay great yeah so we have a flower and it has obviously created a background layer. The first thing we're going to do is delete this little lock so we can unlock the layer. So just drag that lock to the little tiny trash can icon down there. So once we have that, we're going to right click our layer and, we're going to and we are going to click duplicate layer because we want to duplicate this layer. Um, and once we have that, we are going to hold um, shift over here and we are going to drag up first a little bit upwards just so it barely overlaps and then left a tiny bit and there we go now you see what we have here is we have you know the same image but it's just slightly overlapped and now once we have that we are going to right click our layer zero copy we're going to right click that and we're going to click blending options and in blending options we are going to deselect green and blue and once we do this it will create an anaglyph photo so that's how you do it um, and now we can merge these layers by right clicking and selecting merge visible and that will merge these two layers together and now you have this nice 3D um, uh, picture and then of course you can save it as your specified f uh, file so in a glyph.ping we'll save it to desktop and that's pretty much it um, and I'm yeah it's honestly all you have to do and I'd like to thank you for watching and I'll see you later